All right, back to the molten salt magic. Unlike traditional reactors powered by solid fuel rods, MSRs are powered by uranium and thorium dissolved into molten salts. Because the fuel is liquid, waste products from nuclear fission can be extracted with the reactor still running. This continuous cleanup keeps the thorium to uranium reaction humming along by preserving neutrons for fuel production instead of letting them get soaked up by the waste. Liquid fuel salt acts as a coolant too, circulating out and back into the reactor core to deliver heat for the power generation. In Copenhagen Atomics layered onion core MSR, these hot salts are flanked by heavy water that slows down the neutrons so they can be better absorbed by thorium in the salt. And the outer layer of the onion will be a breeding blanket, where additional thorium salts will absorb neutrons produced by the chain reaction within the reactor core, breeding uranium-233. In the final design, this uranium will be transferred from the blanket to the molten salt fuel in the core. When you have liquids, you can actually separate these things out. And it's a mix of chemistry and electrochemistry to do that, but it's a completely autonomous system that runs inside the reactor while the reactor is operating.